This is Cunningham Outdoors. Well, folks, I think this is going to be our last set of the year for bow hunting. It's Sunday, December 19th. It's a lot colder. It's only going to be about maybe, I think the high was 26 today. I'm not sure what we got for temp now, but we're going to go sit way back in the oaks and hope to God they cross through here before it's quitting time. We can hunt till about 428. So when we get back there, we'll, we'll show you how we're looking. Last bow hunt for Cunningham Outdoors for the 2021 season. Okay, folks, here we are. We're finally up in the tree. I thought while I was climbing up the tree that I saw three tails uh, go behind me. So hopefully that's not the only deer that we're going to see tonight. The three that I just busted climbing up the stand. They give her a good 80, 80 yards or 80 yards or so behind me here I just saw the tails go so but there's a lot more deer here so we're hoping they come down that trail in front of me I'll show you that trail right now there you can see the trail going through the woods there you can see it pretty good it's right there I'm hoping that that's the way the deer are going to be coming because if they come they're going to give me either a broadside shot or a quartering away just perfect here it's only about if 10 yards in front of the stand so we'll see how that works out okay guys uh, we got about a nine mile hour wind it's about south southwest so it's going to be kind of be blowing right in our face which will be perfect it's about 30 degrees right now i don't think it's going to drop much less than 28 so we got a good two and a half hours so let's see how it goes hope we'll see you soon with the uh, with deer down Well, folks, I'm not sure if you saw that, but I, I put the GoPro on. They were probably a good 80 to 100 yards in front of me here, crossing through. I think it was the same deer that we jumped when we came in. There's four of them. They walked in front of me, uh, not on the trail we thought they were coming in. So I don't know if the GoPro picked them up, so I'll have to go back and take a look at it, see if we can show you those or not. But hold tight because it's only about a uh, quarter to three yet, so we've got a lot of time left. Hold tight.
I think the GoPro got those guys on tape because they were right on top of us. It was a doe and a nubby fawn. I didn't want to. I didn't want to shoot any does yet because I might be coming out here for the antlerless only season, and I'll give a crack at it then with the with the rifle. Uh, but. If we just get any kind of a decent buck, it'd have to be a really nice spike. We'll consider taking a shot, but let's hope that the, the GoPro picked those up because that's pretty cool. We had it right underneath us. That was neat. They had no idea it was here. Perfect. Another good job by the heck suit. <laughs> okay, we got uh, got about 45 minutes left, so let's hope some more deer. That's our eighth deer already tonight so they are really moving stay tuned well folks we're to the end here we only got about a minute left uh, hopefully you get to see those deer on on video on the GoPro I didn't use the phone tonight I wanted to make sure we could that the GoPro would pick them up but it's probably been my last sit for for the year for 2021 so I know all of our videos haven't been the greatest. There's times where we sat and we didn't see nothing. Um, our gun season was very minimal. But uh, hopefully hopefully we got some of these during our video for you. If not, really appreciate you following us during the 2021 bow and gun season and late season. Uh, we've had fun. Our next uh, adventure when we get into it will be about mid-January. We're going to do some rabbit hunting, so hopefully you can follow us on that. This has been Rich for Cunningham Outdoors. Please consider liking this channel and hit that bell to subscribe to our to our shows. Have a good one. We'll see you next year. Smash the like button, turn on that bell, and subscribe to Cunningham Outdoors.